mini comp yay um, this is my Carter machine uh, royal blue uh, mini comp first up I'm gonna go with feel this gun feels fantastic in your hands it has a humpback frame so it feels fantastic it has a slider trigger so you know just simply I you can't cock without air but it's just uh, I'll show you later it's a, it's a fantastic slider trigger <laughs> this pump stroke is amazing it, it may not be as um, like as, as, as light as a sniper but it certainly is just as smooth this gun is smooth this gun is incredibly smooth it's just smooth <laughs> it's part of the thing because it has dual under cocking arms right here um, it has a, a really really nice barrel um, if you can see it has a thing so the pump can slide along it another thing I like about this gun is these right here uh, you can see the balls very easily I don't know if some of you guys have had phantoms and um, the slots on there I thought from my opinion are uh, lacking they uh, they don't do a very good job of uh, of um, you able to detect the balls I could usually in the in the CCI the phantom ones just see the ball instead of there and I wish he just made it without the without the slots right there um, fan, uh, feed holds 12 rounds um, so it's a nice little feed it, 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 it fits just perfect it's not too far back um, another thing uh, that I dislike about this gun this is the only thing I dislike about this gun so if you look on the 12 gram changer right here it, it, it's tiny it, it's this dinky little thing it has what three two threads three yeah it's dinky so you get this cross thread thing all the time going on you, you know you at an angle cross thread cross see I can't know perfect angle it has to it's kind of a hassle this suck okay there we go I have an L stock for it but I, I like just how small this gun is um, very efficient insanely efficient it also has a thing where you see you can see not see that V so it's almost like it's a little ghost ring kind of thing and I think uh, that's a great idea I think the phantoms are starting doing that now because uh, my friends has one but uh, uh, yeah I, I like how they did that just, you can look right down there these guns have a fantastic weight to them they just they feel it's not like a center of gravity kind of thing you know it's not it's not you know it's kinda of back heavy a little bit but they just when you hold the gun when you hold the mini comp they just they they feel good like you can shoot anything almost they're just so uh, I can't explain it you just you have to hold one they're very bulky as you can see it's very flat and and, uh, and fat kinda of right there um, but I don't mind um, but uh, yeah uh, this gun um, it feels great it really does it shoots darts um, it, it just it feels great in the hands um, it, it just performs really good uh, I mean it's a really beautiful gun but it performs just as well as it looks it, it, it really does and there are these minor things that, that make all the difference slider trigger lighter pump stroke and this really nice feeling humpback frame it just they all combine together and make a well-made stock class marker okay um, real quick I'm gonna show you with the 12 gram how uh, nice the break is on the slider trigger um, and then I'll shoot about uh, a tree at about 20 yards. 12 gram. Isn't normally how I'd load it, but you know, weird angle. Okay. Okay. Now, 12 gram, new, fresh. Okay, pumped. Right here. Whoops. Yeah. Clean break. Just a clean break. Very nice trigger. I love this trigger. I have four tubes of paint here. Remember, I just shot two shots. Um, I won't be shooting these in normal conditions. I will be shooting fast. I won't wait 10 seconds between every shot like I would in a game. So remember, I might only get 35 shots or something. Um, but remember, that's shooting every second, so that's fairly efficient on the 12 gram. I will do a video after this showing, uh, demonstrating uh, really slow. When it's a little bit hot out, I'll, I'll shoot really slow and um, show you how good a, a mini comp would get in a normal game. It's about 687 paint. I have a 686 insert in there.
Done. Anyway, so that was about 35, uh, 34, 35 usable shots shooting every single second. Uh, not going to happen in a game. Let me zoom out here. So uh, about 35 shots shooting every single second. So this is, it, it, that won't happen in a game. So reasonably in a game, you would probably get closer to 45, 40 to 50 shots. Uh, 45 probably usable shots in a game. Um, but yeah, uh, conclusion. Um, I love this gun. Um, it's a fantastic gun. Slider trigger rots, pump stroke rocks, barrel is extremely accurate, even though I suck, like always. This gun is a great gun. It's, it's well put together. And um, um, a lot of people ask me, my friend asked me, you know, people ask me, you know, what, I mean, what does a Carter have over a Phantom? You know, Phantom's, uh, um, I, um, you know, I picked a, this up used for about 500 and um, my friend picked up his Phantom used to drop out for about 150. Okay, so you're talking about a huge difference there. I mean, you're talking um, like what makes this gun better? I can't say, oh well, I will be a better player because of a slider trigger, or I will technically be better than him because I have a lighter pump stroke. Um, you won't be a better player. All these stock class guns were reasonably perform the same, you know. They basically all shoot a paint pot 300 or 280 FPS, and they will all shoot um, the the you know dead on with paint to barrel match and all that crap. But um, it, it's about feel, you know. Um, you're out there to have fun. You're out there to 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 to, to play paintball. Um, when I play out there uh, with my Carter, um, I have fun with this. You know, it's fun to play around with this super light pump stroke, and and I like this slider trigger. It feels uh, better. Um, uh, so I have a lot more fun that way. If someone asks, is, is this gun worth $600? I will say no. Basically what I'm saying is if, is if you're asking if, if a Carter is worth $500, then you probably should not be getting one. If you say, wow, I'd really like a lighter pump stroke, lighter thing, and I'll pay f $600 for it or whatever, then yeah, you know, buy a mini comp or a buzzard or whatever. But, you know, all in all, I love this gun. I will, I will try and keep it for as long as I possibly can. Um, I have that scratch right here that I did something stupid. I'm not even going to tell you, but it, it was pretty stupid. And um, I'm going to uh, actually buy a new valve body or 12 gram and send that into Carter just so I can have it look pretty again. I'm willing to spend the money to do that. I love this gun that much. So, anyway, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my mini comp and me talking about it constantly and stuff. Um, so yeah, have a good one guys.